How's it going, guys? Bradley Sutton from Helium 10 here. Uh, a question I get a lot on the Facebook groups and in our workshops that we do is, hey, I'm looking at my rank in Keyword Tracker, and it's different than the rank that comes up in Cerebro. Why is Helium 10 giving wrong information? Well, the answer is it's not wrong information, okay? Here's what's going on. Take a look here. Um, let's say you're you're in Keyword Tracker, right? And I'm tracking this pure collagen peptides product. And I noticed that collagen peptides powder and collagen peptides, it is unranked, okay? So like it says not in the top 306. But then I just uh, search for this in Cerebro, right? It comes up with uh, 1,216 keywords. Let me see if I can uh, find one of these. Let me just copy this. And I'm going to go here to Cerebro and I'm going to do show phrases that contain collagen peptides that have a number of words, two words. So I know that I can find it. All right. And boom, there it is. And then wait a minute. It says position rank 88, but on keyword tracker, it's unranked. So which one is right? Which one is wrong? The answer is they're both right. How is that possible? Well, remember when, um, uh, keyword tracker is actually going out and searching. If I had boost on, which is this red button right here, it's actually going to be checking for the rank every single hour. Um, since I didn't have boost on, it's checking once a day, every 24 hours. However, on Cerebro, it is not going out and actively uh, tracking your keywords. This is not a keyword tracker. That's why we have you know keyword tracker, right? So that you guys can uh, almost in real time be tracking your ranking. But in Cerebro, look at the last column right here. It says age. This basically means at what point in time that we... Uh, took note of this rank. And so this says less than seven days. That means sometime in the last seven days when we went out and checked this rank, it was posi position 88. Um, so if we actually go to keyword tracker, let me see here. You can see I've been tracking this you know, for quite a while, right? And sometimes it goes unranked and sometimes it's ranked. And it said sometime in the last seven days, it was 88, boom, look at that. On 1231, which is what, three days ago, uh, we track this on my keyword tracker at 88. And what does Cerebro say? Hey, sometime in the last seven days, it is 88. So I hope that answers your question, guys. Cerebro is not going to match up with your keyword tracker unless your rank um, at the time that we tracked it in Cerebro happens to be the current rank. So if you guys want up-to-date uh, keyword position status on your ASIN or your competitor's ASIN, make sure to put it into Keyword Tracker. Uh, if you're just looking for all of the keywords that a certain ASIN, including yours, is ranking for in the top 306 sometime in the last seven or 30 days, then you're going to want to use Cerebro, which, you know, it's an unpractical. Sometimes you'll do a Cerebro search and you're going to come up with two, 3,000 keywords. Obviously, that's impractical to be putting putting in your keyword tracker, right? So you'd only want to put the most important ones in keyword tracker. So guys, make sure to know the difference between when your rank is checked in keyword tracker and when your rank is checked in Cerebro. Thanks a lot.